and I'm speaking with David, right? Correct. Okay, David, now you have a, 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 a placard that says, get your Johnson out of our democracy. Okay, so what happened today? Many people think Boris Johnson is exploiting the British political system. He's not leaving as Prime Minister Assad now. He says he's left as the leader of the Conservative Party. Now, he actually knows that the process to elect a new leader could take weeks, even months. Sure. We believe that he's hoping that within those months and weeks, something can happen. You know that in politics, a day can be a very long time. Many yes. events can occur that can keep somebody as prime minister or take somebody out as prime minister. Now, you have the saying, Johnson should leave. But Johnson will be there till at least next week. Maybe next week. I thought you were going to say October. I don't think he will last, last very long. I believe he has lost his authority uh, as a prime minister. Yes, but uh, did you see the statement from Ukraine? The Ukrainians are very worried that Boris Johnson may be living because he's given them massive support. Okay. I believe this country will support Ukraine. It, it, is, it is as if that is our natural default position. Whichever leader we have, they would support Ukraine, I believe. Mm. Are you a Conservative voter or Labour voter? Like I said before, no party owns me, but I'm more inclined to vote for the Labour Party because they support the public services, the hospitals, education and police, etc. and prison service, all the public services. Uh, I, I, I would feel safer with Labour uh, being in charge of those rather than this Conservative Party who try to make profit out of everything. Well, but if you support Labour uh, then, uh, and Labour makes you happy, then you probably have been miserable since Gordon Brown was Prime Minister. Miserable since. I've been miserable since 2010, mm. I believe, uh, with the onset of austerity. And uh, the, the two parties, the two main parties then, were both going to introduce austerity, but Labour would have introduced a less harsh austerity. But we have suffered since then. And the British people have had nothing, nothing back from, this, from any government since 2010. Every policy has been designed to help people with money and not people with needs. So you accuse the Conservative Party of David Cameron, Theresa May and uh, Boris Johnson of supporting the rich? That's a good question. But please, if I could focus on Johnson, definitely that applies to Johnson. Perhaps less so, perhaps less so to Cameron and May. However, however, uh, uh, Cameron, he, he had the EU referendum in order so he said to unite the Conservative Party and look what's happened. So yes, he is responsible for a big mistake, uh, but I would accuse Johnson in particular of supporting the rich.